welcome to fall at the Magic Kingdom. Kingdom, we're gonna show you all the fall decorations that went up overnight because the first Mickey's Not So Scary Halloween party is this Friday on the 16th. Is it the 16th? 16, okay. yeah. Yeah, so let's come on. Okay, so the first thing that they have is the Mickey pumpkins at the entrance, which are my favorite. Look at how cute. They have the Mickey pumpkins on the entrance with all the fall garland. So here's the fall banners on the train station. Let's go inside and see what they have. Okay, so all of the fall garland is up on the entrance, both coming in and leaving. And look, the pumpkins are out. Oh my gosh, now I'm officially ready for fall. <laughs> At first I was like, no, I'm not ready yet, but so ready. now I'm ready. So here's the entrance, and right when you walk in, you have your first Mickey pumpkin on a light post. Super cute. Right behind you. Yeah? Oh, hello. There's another pumpkin on a light post, and you can see the sea real soon, and the pumpkins over there will show you when we leave. And then up here on City Hall, they look so cute. And then you can see them over here on the Chamber of Commerce. Okay, so let's come up here and see what we can see. So this is where they do character meet and greets, and it is all dressed for fall. See the pumpkins and the flower bed here? Why don't you go stand there and pose? <laughs> Strike a pose, ready? Beautiful. <laughs> Do a pose saying, I'm ready for fall. I don't know what that pose is. Um, like, <laughs> like, where is fall? It's 100 degrees outside. <laughs> <laughs> oh god, we're annoying. Look who it is. <laughs> is he viewing all the fall decorations? <laughs> so over here on the fire station, they have a restroom jack-o'-lantern with Dalmatians and a fire hydrant. It's so adorable. Here, I'll zoom in. So you have the Dalmatian spots, Dalmatian, and the restrooms, which are right this way. Garland on the car barn where the parade comes. Over on the barber shop, you have different mustaches and faces. So we're standing near the flagpole right now, and over here is where they'll put the scarecrows and things, which probably won't be up until I would say right before or maybe the day of the Halloween party. So yeah. those are normally the last to come out, but they're all right here next to the flagpole. So if you're visiting, make sure to take a photo here because it's a really cute photo op area. You see the snowman jack o' lantern on the confectionery. Film so over tape here, right in the middle, yeah. Yeah, over here on the cinema, they have film tape and some more jack-o'-lanterns, and on every single light post, as always, which are my favorite. And then over here, we have more. I can't wait till we can see them lit up. Oh, there's a clown. So there's a clown jack-o'-lantern up there. I don't think I've ever noticed him either. There's the front of Crystal Arts with their jack-o'-lanterns and banners. It looks so festive. So over here back in the alleyway off of Main Street, you have the art festival. And on top of the art festival, which this isn't a building that you can go into, or at least it's not a shop, um, you have paintbrush jack-o'-lantern. And then here, you have a pencil. They have all of the fall floral arrangements up here. More banners. So this is the alleyway that we're down. Right next to the crystal arts looks like it's getting ready to rain. So we're trying to rush through, and there's a lot of people leaving right now because it looks like it's going to rain for a very long time. It's supposed to be a few inches of rain tonight, I think. We've been having really bad weather. On so the left, there's one with a rabbit coming out of the hat on the white So hat. right here on the House of Magic, you have a rabbit coming out of a hat. I'm gonna zoom in. Some cards, a crystal ball, 
We have a magic wand. So on top of the bakery, I can't figure out what this one is. What is that one? One in the middle? Yeah, I don't really know what that is. And what else would you have on an ice cream parlor except ice cream jack-o'-lanterns? Look at the sundae on the end. I don't know if you can see it. I'm zoomed way in because it's kind of crowded with everyone leaving right now. But those are adorable. Look, so over here on Casey's, we have some fries. Is that a hot dog right there? Yeah, that's a hot dog. Yep, a hot dog. That kind of looks like Mickey's face here, huh? Up there? It does look like Mickey's face. It's getting very dark. I don't know if you can tell, but it's just lightning off that direction. We've got some more ice cream cones on top of the ice cream parlor. I love those. Those are really cute. And you can see all of these light up at night during the Halloween party. Or if you come at night, they'll have them. Okay, so now we're over here in the hub <laughs> trying to hurry, but they have all of the Mickey wreaths all over the light posts here. Right next to the pathway to Adventureland, you have some pumpkins. It's kind of in fun to the see the different garden. waves that come up because it's like the first waves. Ladies and gentlemen, oh, yeah. boys oh. and girls. Wait, what's getting ready? <laughs> Due to inclement weather, oh. this performance of the Move It, Shake It, Mouska Dance It Street Party has oh. been canceled. Oh, Once that's again, what everyone's waiting on. And here, some more over here. I always like seeing the first so wave of, of yeah. Halloween stuff because they always do the, the poles first and a little bit of pumpkins and then they start filling in all the planters. Oh yeah, that's and right, they do. You start seeing more and more over the coming weeks. But usually they have a lot by the first, um, not so scary. Right? Yeah, they have everything done by then, I think. Which we are going to next week. Not the first one. Not the first one. No, we're but we're going, going next, next week. Oh, I'm so excited. This might be the earliest we've ever done. Yeah, I think right? so. I'm excited. What's the tea, Matt? Oh my gosh. <laughs> we need to leave. <laughs> Sleepy Hollow is decorated for fall with their garland. More over here on the light posts. And the Christmas shop, which is always decorated for the holidays. But they did add this fall garland on the light posts. They always do really good fall decorations over here. Yeah, I like it back Although here in Frontierland. They have an ice cream sandwich with churros. <gasps> with churros? Like, yeah, I think you need that. I might need to have it. So we're right here next to the Haunted Mansion. I wanted to check into Memento Mori and see the 50th anniversary merchandise that they got. It's actually for Disneyland, so I don't know if they have anything here. I saw it on Twitter and apparently there were people camping out and waiting. It's a really big deal, so I wanna see if we can find anything in the gift shop back here. All right, so. I'm actually kind of digging this. So it says the Disneyland Resort on here. It's going to be a swinging wake. How much is this? How much is that? $24.99. Do you see the detail in the mug? It's really pretty. That's gonna come home with us. <laughs> so you have some 50th anniversary ears. With, that's adorable, actually. Hold on, I don't know if oh, they're showing up. Oh, that's Can the Disney see? room one, yeah. Yeah, those are yeah, so Yeah, and this one cute. is $24.99 as $24 well. $24.99? Here's a nice hoodie. What does this say? Now begins, now begins another, another year. year of heavily oh. striking fear. <gasps> that is adorable. And then it has the years. That's really Wow, neat. how much is that? This one is 49 49.99. That's on the front. That's really cool, I like that. They have a 50th throw. Those are more into <laughs> light up ears. Light up ears. How much are those? These are lavender. I don't know what lavender is. Oh. 16.99 for the Christmas ornament. I really like the back of it. It says the 50th anniversary. Then you have some Dooney and Burke bags. Three bags. Wow, that's really nice. It's a really pretty Seems navy color. That's navy, right? It's kind of hard to tell in the light here, but I think I, it's navy. Is it? Yeah, it looks navy with the gold. It's kind of metallic, so it's kind of hard to tell. Is that black or navy? Yeah. It's really hard to tell in the lighting here. Then they have a larger tote bag down here. It looks like they only have three of these left. So here's another t-shirt. They have this v-neck t-shirt here that has this on the front. This one's really soft. And this one is $34.99. Okay, so now that we've seen all of the fall decorations around this area, we're starting to feel some raindrops. So we're gonna go see what type of merchandise we can find in the stores. 
So here is where I was thinking the seasonal merchandise would be, but it looks like they just still have all of the American stuff, which is what they do for summer, for 4th of July. I'm not seeing any fall merchandise yet. All right, you guys, so that is it for all of the fall decorations at Magic Kingdom. There is many more to so come. Far, yes. So far, yes. So far, yes. There's much more to come, a lot more festivities that we are excited to share. But we hope that you enjoyed this video. Thank you for hanging out with us. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up. Please don't forget to subscribe. And we will see you in our next video. Bye, guys. See you real soon.